Hello though, if you want to sell your Graft Luna and you want to bridge that into the actual Luna into the Terra Bridge, actually you are in the right place. So let's do this really, really, really quick. Now, in this case, I'm going to be showing you how to do this into the Coinbase.com application. If you want to do this into another uh, exchange, the process might be a little bit different, but I'm pretty sure uh, that there are a few things that weren't uh, a little bit different that we're going to be doing so far. So the first thing you want to do here is to have your coin base already opened and as you can see here's my grabbed Luna classic so what you guys want to do first of all and most uh, interesting here is to go into send and receive all right so uh, before I continue I most tell you guys that if you are using a desktop or if you are using your phone number you might want to have opened already uh, two more tabs so here I want to have my bridge dot Terra that money so I can make the bridge from uh, Terra from actual Ethereum into my Terra and then what I want to do is to open Terra that money so what we want to do is to create a wallet and we want to send our money from Coinbase into a new wallet, into an actual Terra wallet. So first of all, now that I have everything uh, here already, I want to go back. And uh, I'm going to go into sign into my MetaMask account. So as you can see here, I have this already set as a um, extension. So if you have this as an application, as an extension, it's totally okay for you. Uh, what I want to do here is to send this money from my exchange and receive that into MetaMask. So this is the first step I want to do, right? So I'm going to choose my network. I'm going to go into Ethereum. Now, if you want to import the Luna and you don't see that in here, you need to enable first the contract. You need to import that. So as you can see, I'm into Etherscan to follow and copy the real contract. So there are a few videos that can be helping you to copy and paste the contract. If you don't want to just trust this guy, if you just want to find a specific contract so you can be really sure that the contract is the legit. So you want to look for etherscan.io and in here you want to look for your Graft Luna uh, token contract. So once you find your contract here, I'm going to copy the address. I'm going to go into my MetaMask, I'm going to hit uh, down here into Assets, and here I'm going to go into Import Tokens, I'm going to paste here my Luna, my token, so here's the contract address, and I'm going to hit, I'm going to hit in here the token symbol, which is actually in here, I'm going to go into Add Custom Token, in my case this already has been added, so if I clicked into the X button, here it is, I'm going to scroll a little bit down, and here is my Luna token, right? So, let's just go back. I want to copy my contract wallet for MetaMask and I, I want to go back here into Coinbase. I want to send all my stuff and I'm going to paste here. I'm going to go into continue. I'm going to send that directly into my MetaMask uh, wallet. Now here into this example, you might see here that your Grab Luna has been sent to this specific contract. So this might be taking you less than 10 minutes. So you can go back into your wallet and see that your money is now available. Now, now that you have your money into MetaMask, let's bridge that into our Terra wallet. So for that, I want to go into my Terra money and go into create my wallet. If you don't have a wallet, it's really easy to set up a Terra station a wallet. So just go and select the, um, the option that fits for you the best. In my case, I want to choose the desktop. Once you download your Terra station, it's going to be looking like this. So here's my dashboard. Now what I want to do is to connect my wallet. So either you can recover a wallet and pull that. In my case, I want to choose a new wallet. So now that I have a new wallet, here is my Luna. Coins required to post transaction. So in order to receive your money, you have to choose the buy uh, option. You can choose the Binance Exchange or the KuCoin. So in our case, what we want to do first of all is to go, now they have our Terra station, you don't have to be worried about that. Just for a second, I'm going to go back into my bridge of Terra, which is this one, right? So what I want to do here is to connect my wallet in order to continue. So now that you have here your wallet, what you want to do is to go into the send option. You want to always, always choose shuttle. And here from Ether, I want to choose that uh, into Terra Classic. And here's the asset, and here's the amount, and the destination address. So that's the reason why we created a new wallet from Terra. So here you want to put the maximum amount and the destination address. I'm going to go back here into, I just need to copy here my Terra. I paste it in here and I choose next so I can receive my money and bridge that into Terra. 
after you make your transfer, it's gonna be looking like this. Complete transferring Luna from Ether to Terra transaction will basically be a MetaMask, right? So that's what happened. Now, the last thing you want to do is to go back into your Terra application and here into your wallet, you should see that your Luna might be available. Uh, just you have to be really patient because this might be taking a while. So the transaction might be completed uh, right away, but you have to be a little bit patient to receive your money from your Ether into the Terra Station and receive that into your Terra wallet. And voila, just like that, you have your Luna here into your wallet. I mean, you have to grab Luna and you have sent that and transfer that into the actual Luna uh, 2.0, or I'm not pretty sure what they're calling it so far. So there you have it, guys. If you want to buy real actual Luna here's the buy option so you can choose an exchange in my case I love to choose Binance because it's gonna be really really simple to buy uh, Luna and just uh, receive that into my terror station so I don't have to be dealing with that so hopefully guys that's a pretty useful video for you thank you so much for watching this video I'm gonna leave you a link down below in the description so you can have all these links and you can see it for yourself and of course and I'm not gonna leave you the contract address right away I'm gonna leave you the link of the ethos hand uh, so you can see that this uh, contract is totally legit so you can copy and paste that into your bridge station into your metamask and you can be really really sure that this is the right contract so thank you once again for watching the video guys and i'll see you next time